To be a Division I recruit, you need much more than God-given athletic ability. At Lakewood High, a pair of Piners are setting a prime example of how to get to the next level. With Chappelle Cook giving a verbal to Temple and Detrell Reed garnering a number of FCS offers, Coach L.J. Clark praises his seniors for being role models for the entire school. Detrell and Chappelle also excel very well in the classroom. You know, there are three three kids, GPA. They're over close to 1,000 on the combined two on the SAT part. Uh, Tyrese Beverett started off by going to Stony Brook two years ago. Now last year, Mo Diawara got a full ride to go to Wagner. Again, we, we preach, our kids are on progress reports. Where we, we monitor that very, very closely, just so those kids will have an opportunity. Hey, yo, undercover two, undercover two. Lock down! The college talent isn't done there. Amir Taylor, a junior linebacker and running back, got his first D1 offer from Temple, thanks in large part to all the attention the Owls gave to Chappelle Cook. Because of them, I got my offer. If it wasn't for them, they would never knew me. Because, you know, it comes through the whole recruiting process when they meet them and I come in the room with Chappelle to watch how big they liked him, how they wanted to offer him, how they liked the trail a lot. So I kind of I kind of look up to them, too. Speaking of Cook, he will be a linebacker in college, but he's adding quarterback duties for his senior season of high school ball. It's no surprise to see this stellar athlete learning on the fly and getting a grasp on the position. Lakewood will use his elite speed in a variety of ways. I love quarterback because it's more of a leadership role, and I love being a leader on the field, being very vocal. And for me to be quarterback, that's a lot of trust for my coach putting in my hands. And for me to be, be my senior year, just got to come out here and ball out and do what I got to do. Coach L.J. Clark has changed the culture at Lakewood. The Piners are no doubt contenders for a deep postseason run, but they're not going to let the preseason hype get in the way of what needs to be done in order to play in December. This upcoming season, we're all looking to do great things. Like we're all fired up about the season. We're looking. We're honestly looking to get a championship ring. And we're just going to be very humble, and we're just you know grateful to the opportunity to play a great game of football and just stay level-headed. I mean, we haven't done anything yet. Everybody's zero zero, and everybody thinks they can win a state championship at this point. For more Jersey Shore sports, log on to ShoreSportsZone.com.